Hello Cancerians, welcome in, welcome to your reading, sending you all so much love in light Cancer. Let's begin this message for you. What does Cancer need to know at this time, Holy Spirit? What does Cancer need to know? Okay, overall in energies, we have return, second chance, that is so, <laughs> second chance opportunity making amends. There's a return here with somebody who's Thinking about an opportunity with you. I'm going to show you this up close so you can see. Return, second chance, opportunity, making amends. You could you could be some apprehensive or, so, or cautious about maybe there might have been some pain here in the past with this energy. Or something that happened that could have been painful. There's silence now between the two of you or there, there's been silence. We have an apology, obs obscurity, secrets, mystery, and concealing. Forgiveness. We have two energies that say return. We have return, sorry, forgiveness. This is somebody who could be silent, silent for, or there could be silence between the two of you. Or they could have been silent in the past. Frozen, no words, stonewall. Okay, mystery, concealing. They could have had secrets. This is someone that could have had a lot of secrets, Cancer. Let's get a monology for you. There is an apology here with somebody who's returning for a second chance. This is why I like to do readings and continuations for cancer. It's kind of interesting how that, that's quite profound. Making amends, making amends, wanting to say sorry and you know make amends with you. Working through their fears, could be a Scorpio. It could be working through their fears, cancer. This person's returning back or somebody here is returning back. Someone whom you do have silence with or there's, there's silence with this energy. Uh, because of concealing could something that they concealed or potentially something that they, they find you mysterious or they could they could be wondering what it is you're doing right now. This this feels to me like a lot of um, high priestess energy with the silence and secrets. Okay, that's confirmation from my four legged loyal companion. The energy is gaining momentum. So something here is changing. It's, it's finally trying to, I mean, I feel like there's a person here who's going to break out of a silence, some sort of silence here. It says second chance, making amends, working through their fears, looking at the bigger picture. This energy could be looking, you know, maybe, you know, seeing an up. That's so profound. I mean, it's almost like, it's almost like the same message. Same, same exact message. The return. I don't know if I'm going to, if I'm going <laughs> to title this reading the return there's two energies that say return we have libra energy a new romantic cycle begins for you i love the purple in these cards so it's a new romantic cycle whether it's somebody that's returning or you know again it could be a past life so many you know who this is about okay you know who this reading is about I don't need to, I don't need to really go around and around. You know who this is about. If you're watching this reading, the person that you're thinking about, that is who this reading's for, whoever it is, <laughs> whoever it is. Let's, um, let's continue with the monology. It says that adjustments are required. So there could be, there, there definitely could be a change here that may be taking place. So here, somebody may be working through their fears here, the adjustments. That's what I'm getting. Where an adjustments, making adjustments. Oh, wow. Fiery climax approaching. Aries energy. You are good enough. Okay, hold your vision. Virgo. This is Virgo energy. So this is somebody who is seeing the, the possibilities for a new romantic cycle with you. Okay. Let's continue. <clears throat> The energy is gaining momentum here. It feels like the justice card, you know, a new beginning and a decision to have um, to have a new romantic cycle. Someone may be defeated, you know, feeling defeated or completing a cycle. What else does Cancer need to know for this reading? There's silence between you and this person. Oh, I just saw the justice. I just almost saw the justice and it went back in the deck. Okay. We have the King of Pentacles here with the Ten of Wands pushing through their fears, working through their fears, Knight of Wands, the sun, there it is. Thank you, spirit, and the justice. There's a new beginning here with this person. 
there's news coming in with this page of wands could be exciting news or something new there's something there's something about a new romantic cycle we have the sun and the justice i feel like this is somebody that could have ended their old um, non-conventional ways with the ten of wands and the knight of wands they could have sagittarius in their chart libra uh, i was going to say <laughs> the leo energy Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, a new romantic cycle is beginning and I feel I'm not going to change my, my storyline. I feel like you know this person. Who could, who could be silent right now? We have the Justice. What is this card? And the Seven of Wands. So an obstacle here in the reverse. So an obstacle here is being removed. Whatever that could have been. A younger fire sign. I don't know. Okay, this energy is ending, putting putting a burden down or something that weighed, weighed heavy on them. Could have been the obstacle. Could have been the obstacle here that was in the in the way. Something was could have been in the way and now it's been removed. I'm also going to see say that. The energy is gaining momentum here. There, there's a sense of, I don't know why I said spirituality. Probably because I was looking at this cross. So this, this energy I feel like is going to ask you, this is who's asking for an apology or asking for... Um, to say here it says return return forgiveness and saying sorry the justice you know sometimes the justice could be an apology as well so um, a new romantic cycle is beginning it's beginning because an obstacle has been removed i don't know take it how it resonates someone's gaining gaining a, a sense of direction i'm also hearing that Let's get some oracles to continue this reading. What else does Cancer need to know for this? Okay, Spirit's telling me to take reflecting. You could be dealing with a Virgo. We have Hermit, Shadow Work, Soul Searching, Deep Introspection, Evaluation, Hermit Energy, Void Period. So there could be a healing here of inner childhood, healing of inner child wounds that could have had somebody here operating in a very uh, unpredictable, inconsistent way of like you know not, not this is ending somebody is completing a cycle here of of um inconsistency the energy is gaining momentum something is changing this is a void period which makes sense why we have this silence okay this mystery there could be this mystery going on between you and this person cancer at this time because because you may not be speaking so there is a return here. I feel like someone has could have could be doing at this time, who could have been doing a lot of shadow work in self self introspection, deep introspection. Okay, says here void period, even doing light work. I mean, I don't know, transcending, getting past conflict, spiritual awakening. It says it says inner shift, inner shift. So that's inner work, shadow work. Take it how it resonates. And that's typically when people come back and they apologize, okay? Because they've, they've had to look in the, in the mirror, okay? They've had to look in the mirror here. And then the, the justice could be a, a, an energy of karma. This could, the, could, this could be an energy of karma, of a decision being made. A contract, there could be a contract, a new contract. A new romantic cycle is beginning. So this could be a new contract. Um, with it, with an energy that could be very much so completing a karmic cycle that they could have carried for some time that they, they this became some sort of baggage for for them this is this inconsistency and that is what they may be reflecting about at this time cancer okay what else does cancer need to know what else does cancer need to know Thank you. Being guided, asking for guidance, feeling guided, seeing signs and synchronicities. Okay, says your guardian angel, spirit guides are assisting in this situation. We have the sun here, which is a lot of happiness, but it's also a new energy. It is new energy. We have a new romantic cycle is beginning here for you. I don't know what this king of pentacles is, but you know, this may be the person here that is overcoming a situation to, I just heard begin afresh because they're gaining new perspective seeing the truth clear action honesty communication the truth being spoken so that is the truth being spoken 
gaining new perspective, honesty, and communication. Take it how it resonates. That is, that is what is showing for you, Cancer. That is your current energy. There is somebody here that is returning to, to the, this return. They're returning here with an apology after some time of silence, after after maybe something going through something that might have weighed heavy on them. But you know, they're they're, they're being guided. Someone is being guided and asking for assistance because they're going through something i feel like that could, could be also karmic with this justice that is what causes people to go within and reflect inner shift to create an inner shift here in somebody that could have had a lot of secrets okay there could have been a mystery about this person see we have closed off at the bottom of the deck resistant guarded blocking pride this is the wounded warrior nine of wands yeah, it says wounded, lost, wounded. There, there could have been rejection here in the past. Who knows? Maybe this person now is being rejected. Okay, and that's their karma. I don't know where I got that from, but we have the Page of Wands with the Chariot, which is Cancer's major arcana and the Two of Cups. So clearly, there's a there's a Cancerian here that that is moving towards a partnership, love connection, a union. And I feel like this is new and you're going to have a choose wisely because I feel like you're going to have a choice here to make. You may very well so have somebody here from that you do know here asking, you know, coming back here all, the, all of a sudden they come back healed. They're like a new person. And it's like they come, they, they return here for a second opportunity with an apology and you're going to get really confused. You're going to become really confused, I feel. Yep. Because you're going to have an offer here in love. Ace of Cups. I do feel I do feel a lot of cups here that may be offered to you. So <laughs> you may have to hold back. I, I don't know what the, this is. Could be a Leo. You may have Leo in your chart. There may be competition here. <clears throat> I see a lot of choices um, in the near future with... And you're going to venture off. Someone here is going to venture towards something new. And leave options in the pad or not leave some sort of people leave people or resist other people it could be a water sign cancer pisces scorpio you're gonna have an offer here from somebody that it's feeling guided that it's being guided Give me one more energy for this reading for cancer okay this person feels lost and wounded give me one more energy for cancer thank you spirit could be a uh, sagittarius i think i mentioned uh this, this says here jupiter so this to me is it's an inspire risk taking action we have this knight of wands so adventure new opportunity okay there's fortune here uh jupiter energy is very very lucky it's typically it's typically sagittarius energy your person does not have to be Sagittarius. Um, I do see somebody that is in pursuing here of passions, new opportunity, adventurous. That's very much like Sagittarius. That is, that is a true Sagittarian. Okay, Sagittarius is, is known for being very uh, extremely uh, non-conventional. And no, no offense to Sagittarius. I like Sagittarius very much. So, but they, they never get married. It's really hard for, for the Sagittarius male actually for the women also to to settle down because they they, they pursue path, you know adventure and passions and new opportunities um, that is just who they are so there's a person here taking action to come towards you okay doesn't have to be a sagittarius but it could be if i'm speaking about that okay pluto i feel like a person has ended some sort of control issue that's something that they might have had to let go of or, you know, mood swings or, or manipulation patterns. Five of Swords, okay, control here. Something could have happened around the summertime. Okay, we have the Ace of Pentacles with the Ace of Swords. Now, Cancer, this, these are two Aces. So this may either happen around this coming summer, okay, the next year coming summertime, because we have a timing card. And I don't want to disregard that and say, okay, something could have happened during the summer. And then quite frankly, you may be someplace else around the world. So it, it, it's a timing card here. It does say growth. 
okay? And then there's a beautiful sunset or sunrise ocean, okay? Depending on where you are, again, in the world. So there's a timing card for summer and time here. I feel like there is a new beginning here with a manifestation in the form of a breakthrough with an energy who's going to take decisive action. Doesn't have to, you don't have to wait until the summer, okay? I just said that that's just something I want to mention that with the, the timing card that's, that's showing for you. But we do have a new, a new beginning, a new beginning here because the aces are new beginnings. It says a new financial start, a stable romance, a breakthrough, decisive action, communication, mental clarity, and sudden truth. We continue to see that sudden truth here from an energy. Could be a Scorpio, could be a Scorpio Cancer that's at a distance from you. I want to get some of these for you and then I'll change decks to end the reading cancer. I'm sending you so much love and like. So unexpected messages, texts, I stay up at night thinking of you. You are divinely protected. I always like to say, make, make sure that you know that cancer. Okay, you are never alone. You are always protected. We have magician, Gemini, Virgo energy, truth again, truth being revealed. And there's something here that is not, uh, let me see what that is. Okay, that's the expression we've been seeing from someone from your past. Memory, Six of Cups. Okay, Memories, Six of Cups. And that is a return. The Six of Cups is a return, Cancer. You know, it might not apply to all of you, but that is what I see here. Both two, two energies that talk about a return here with somebody here apologizing. So take it how it resonates. Could be a Scorpio here. We have Scorpio, magic, reverse spell work. I just finished saying you are divinely protected. I felt the need to let you know that. There's passion here, lust, obsession. No one compares to you. Will you give me a chance? We have this card. This, this energy says second chance. Will you give me a chance? A twin flame. Somebody whom you have a twin flame soul connection with. Okay. So this is somebody you do know, I feel. This is someone you do know. Give me one more energy for Cancer to end this reading. Okay. Okay, regret. Someone feels remorse for the way they treated you. Learning a lesson. Twin flame, again, second time. This person's in your life to teach you a spiritual lesson. I feel like that has been you in this person's life to teach them a spiritual lesson. You might have gone silent on this person, but I feel like there's a very strong sense of awakening again, learning a lesson, going through some sort of karmic situation. Expect the unexpected. I'm also going to say that because the return here for me feels like somebody who's going to be out of the blue, out of the blue, they're just, they're just going to show up. I mean, they may just show up. I mean, who knows? They, they, this may be unexpected for you. Let's get some of these. I knew that I needed something else to end the reading with. I wasn't sure exactly what. We have success. Okay, with wealth. Okay, so your money looks amazing. So wealth and success. Okay, what else for Cancer, Holy Spirit? What else does Cancer need to know? Okay. What else does Cancer need to know? Thank you. Okay, so that is very good fortune for you. Great good fortune. The wheel, although it's not the wheel of fortune, it says here indecisiveness, allowing your life to ramble. Take it how it resonates. Okay, we have Rose. Romance is in the air. Okay. Red roses may be significant. A goal-oriented person. Okay, so a romance with a goal-oriented person and they secret and admire. Someone here likes you and said, I feel like I feel like you're gonna have choices. You're gonna have a choice here to make because there's somebody here that is coming in to apologize to you after some time of silence. This person's gonna take action to come to to come your way. You will be shown the way. It's funny, I just said to come your way. You will be shown the way. There also be feel, feel like somebody here feel uh, it's being guided. Someone is being guided in this connection. Okay, there's clearly twin flames, twin flame energy, twin flame soulmate energy. Give me one more for Cancer. We have this Pluto here with the Scorpio. Dragon, beware of self, self delusion. I feel like that has ended the transformation. Okay, carriage, a journey, either physical or mental. So there's been a clearly a transformation. Someone could have been, the Seven of Cups could talk about illusions, confusions, okay? So the end of a, some sort of illusion, okay? Happiness and the tree could be an earth sign. Affairs with your family and there's happiness. So you're happy, your happiness looks at, the, your happiness, success within your career and life, 
could be family life affairs with your family okay see a lot of happiness um you might have had to you might have been the person here who could have gone through this metamorphosis transformation of the death card okay after after an ending you might have been have had this resilience about you i feel like a lot of you are entering into a happiness and ending a self beware of self delusion it's a, it's a self delusion here somebody could have been under okay success assured with good plans and hard work so there is guaranteed success for you cancer i'm sending you all so much love and light let me know if the reading resonated with you i'll be back soon with another message cancer until then namaste